Hello guys, welcome back to this channel and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can write a Java program that will allow you to print out a right angle triangle like this one that you can have on the screen here and as you can see this triangle is made up of um, art signs. So let us start coding and as you can see here this number 14 is making reference to the number of rows uh, that uh, the number of rows that make up this triangle all right make sure that you have your input object declared and you have also imported the scanner class so the first thing to do is to declare an integer variable that i'm going to call rows then after that i'm going to write an output statement so inside here i'm going to write a message that will prompt the user to type a value so i'm going to say enter the number of rows then i'm going to write my input statement i will say rows console that next int so as you know next int is um, a predefined method so this is going to be used to allow the user to enter the value from his keyboard so after doing that it's now time for me to write my four loops so the first four loop uh, i will say for int equal to zero i less than variable rows and I'm going to increment the value of i. Then inside the curly braces, I'm going to add another for, state, for loop statement. And I will say for int y equal to variable rows minus i. And the condition is going to be i y must be greater than zero. And I'm going to decrement the value of y. So in here, I'm going to write system out that print line, and I want to print the space. Okay, so whenever this condition is going to be met, then the program is going to output the space. So I need to use the print method instead of the print line method. I'm going to add another for loop statement, and this time around, I'm going to say for int j equal to zero, then the condition will say j must be less than or equal to i and i'm going to increment the value of j then inside the curly braces i'm going to add an output statement that will say i'm going to print the at sign because the triangle as you could see was made up of at signs so you could put a different sign here be it a star or a symbol but i'm going to choose to put the at sign like this all right so then i need to remove uh, okay use the print method instead so down here i'm going to write an output statement and i will use the print line method and i'm going to print an empty string so this is going to force the program to come at the next line okay so whenever this condition is met the second one is met the third one is met until it reaches here then the program will come back on the next line so that's it so let me now run the program and see the output of our program and as you can see enter the number of rows so i'm going to type in an integer value so this is going to determine the number of rows of uh, the triangle so i typed nine and as you can count we're going to have nine rows making up this triangle all right if i choose to type four for example and as you can see we have in four rows if i choose to type five we're going to have five rows so guys that was it concerning how you could develop a java program that will allow you to output or print out a right angle triangle like the one we have in on the screen right now so i hope this video was informative and please don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this one let's meet in the next video